Today, we're gonna to be trying out some Klondike cones. YouTube, welcome to the channel. My name is Jason. Here on this channel, I do a lot of food and product reviews. So if you're new here, please hit that subscribe button down there. Like I said, today we are checking out Klondike cones. Okay, Klondike cones, new product out by Klondike. It is... Cone Sweet Cone, new Klondike cones. Our, delish, our new delicious cones feature a distinctive swirled shaped top with sauce that travels through the entire center of the cone. Delicious toppings and the fan favorite chocolate cone tip. Okay, so it looks like they have several different flavors here. We have, so we have double down chocolate and classic chocolate cones. The ones I have here, unicorn dreaming and vanilla chillin' cones and nuts for vanilla and classic chocolate cones. So it shows those, but when I'm looking at the box, it's also showing one that they don't have up there is vanilla and strawberry. This middle one here. I don't know why they didn't have that on the website there. Hmm. All right, so I have the Unicorn Dreaming, which is strawberry and bubblegum frozen dairy dessert, strawberry sauce core, a chocolate coating, and then we also have the vanilla one, which is vanilla chillin', a vanilla frozen dairy dessert, chocolate sauce core, and a chocolatey coating. Okay, if you're interested, um, nutrition facts, the vanilla one is 220 calories for one cone, the unicorn one is 190. 10 grams of fat for vanilla, seven grams for unicorn. Chill to the core, yummy sauce core in every bite. And a chocolate tip in there. All right, so let's go ahead and crack this open and try a vanilla one first. Vanilla chili. Okay, here is the packaging that comes in. How do, what do we do with this? Call that cone chill. Use cone like a pin and bowl your best score. Okay, we're not gonna do that. Am I supposed to take the whole label off? We just will anyways. Okay, making a mess here our little top off. Okay, there is our cone. Let's try this out. Very soft. I just took these out of the freezer, so they're not like really rock hard because this is what, frozen yogurt? So. Haven't got to the chocolate sauce that's going down the middle. There it is. Um, this is just okay. Nothing special. There's more of that sauce going through the middle. Let's just try the comb. This one, the chocolate and vanilla, nothing spectacular. Mm-hmm. Chocolate tip down there at the end of the cone. Yeah. Just a chocolate and vanilla cone. Nothing amazing there. This is the one I really want to try is the unicorn. And this one is what? Strawberry and bubblegum flavored? Okay. Take that little topper off. There is a look at that one. Okay. Try the strawberry side. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, that is definitely bubblegum tasting. I don't know, we'll see how strawberry and bubblegum go together. I think I would have rather had that instead of bubblegum ice cream on that side, 
maybe like Blue Moon or like the blue from Superman ice cream rather than bubblegum. The issue I'm having with these is their frozen yogurt. It's not that I have anything against frozen yogurt. I just don't know if it really works with these. Like, I'm curious, do the other, let me go back to their website. Do other Klondike products use uh, frozen yogurt in them? Like I say, it's not bad. I don't hate them. I just don't think I love them to where I would get these again. Sorry as I'm talking with my mouth full. Looks like there's a, I don't know if I can pick it up in there. Just the slightest layer of like chocolate coating inside the cone. You know, you don't really taste it. I'm not tasting the chocolate taste, but I should when I get down to the chocolate core or the chocolate tip. If you, if you look really close, right there between the blue and pink, you see that little darker line there. That's the strawberry filling that's going through the middle. So it goes all the way down to the bottom, but it's so thin, you don't even know it's there. You don't even taste it. There, I'm to the chocolate tip. So it's just the very, very, very bottom. How do I feel about these? I don't know. I'm not super impressed. I won't get them again. I think if you're a fan of like the Choco Taco, that ice cream treat, that's like a taco with ice cream in it and chocolate stuff on it. If you like that, I'm not a big fan of those. I know a lot of people think they're the greatest ice cream treat there is. I just don't like those very much. I think if you like those, maybe you'd be more of a fan of these because it's kind of along the same line, sort of. Yeah, they're okay. I just don't love them. I think there's better Klondike treats out there. I think those shakes that they have now in the pouches, which I still haven't found strawberry. I wish I could find a strawberry one. All I can find in the store is vanilla and chocolate. Um, I like the vanilla ones. They're good. I like those a lot better than these. But there you go. Let me know in the comments below. Have you tried these? What do you think of these? And did you try some of those other flavors on there? Maybe some of those are better. Like I said, this the unicorn one was definitely better than the just the plain vanilla and chocolate one. I like the unicorn one a little better. But again, I won't purchase these again because they're just not anything spectacular. Like I said at the beginning of the video, if you're new here, hit that subscribe button down there. Hit that bell notification notified every time I upload a new video. And I'll see you guys next time. Nothing special. And just in case you didn't, um, you get four of each. So there's eight cones in here, you get four of each flavor. I think I would rather have them just sell them in individual, not individual, like, like four packs, where like if I did want to get these again, which I don't think I will, I would just want that flavor. I don't want these ones. I don't want four of those that are gonna go to waste. So I wish you could, and maybe you can, if, you, if you've seen them in the store and you can buy them individually or in packs of their own flavor, throw it down in the comments below. I'll see you guys next time.